What's up, Aquarius? I have been wanting to call y'all Aquafina for whatever reason. But what's up, Aquarius? This is your lifted tarot reader, Stoner Girl Tarot. Back with your June 2020 tarot reading. Aquarius, this is for your sun, moon, rising, and Venus. And this is not your personal reading. This is a reading for the collective under the sign of Aquarius. So just take whatever applies and let the rest fly. I really encourage you to watch the video for your moon sign so that you can get an accurate um, picture of your situation. And if you can't tell by the title, I encourage you to watch this video while high so that you can have an elevated experience. Sit back, relax, and meditate to the images that you see on your screen while you focus on the messages that I am giving you from my spirit guides. So Lee, Aquarius, I just did the reading for Libra, but Aquarius, Aquafina. <laughs> so you are receiving communication from someone or at least you won't communication from someone yeah this is going to it's like you're getting good news and like um this is in regards to a situation you thought was over um if it's not a love situation um, you're getting information that is going to lift you up, whether it be, you know, emotionally, financially, someone giving you a helping hand. Someone is delivering good news that's like going to really lift your spirits. So. Both of these cards came out, so. Aquarius, the person that you're thinking about, this person may not have wanted a relationship or a commitment with you, um, but their current energy shows that they're basically becoming less selfish. In the past, they may have been selfish with you. Um, yeah, someone wanted clarity. Yeah, so in the recent past, someone got clarity because the situation came back to life. And currently, Aquarius, your person... You know, like I said, if they have been closed off from you in the past, they're no longer that way. And that could be the person who is bringing you this good news. If it's not in regards to a love situation, it's something that you thought that you could never have, you could never get. This could possibly mean a job or, you know, some money that you wanted, but you thought you could never get it. Yeah, so in the near future, we we do have, let me clarify first. Yeah, in the near future, again, clarifying this, we have the Justice Reverse, Page of Pentacles Reverse, and the Death Card Upright. So again, this tells me that in the near future, you're going to have a new beginning with something that you thought was dead, something that you thought was over, something that you probably were pissed about because you felt like you didn't get your just due. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, Aquarius. What's the outcome? I'm not sure what cards came out, so there's a celebration coming. 
I feel like whoever you're dealing with, Aquarius, they were, again, very closed off from you. They didn't want to be that man or that woman that you wanted. And there's a celebration coming in regards to this good news. Yeah. Um, expect this person to be very honest with you. They may deliver a brutally honest truth to you. Yeah, because we have the chariot here, which has to do with someone. Um, hold on just a second. Yeah. From someone who just didn't want to focus on love and relationships. But now they do. Which is a good outcome. The person that you're thinking about, Aquarius, and as far as the action that they, they're going to take towards you, they didn't want to offer you anything in the past, like I said before. And so they're coming out of... Um, being disconnected from you again it's the same message basically this person could have um, broken up with someone recently yeah like and they also they don't feel that they have closure with you Aquarius or they're bringing you closure to the situation. Yeah, and so we have the two, the two of wands upright. So that indicates partnership. That indicates two people. Um, it, can, it can indicate a partnership as well. But it's like someone is carefully and really seriously considering moving towards you. Again, this energy could be vice versa. That could be you feeling that way. So your advice, Aquarius. Put the uh, uh put the horns away, Aquarius. Like don't bite this person's head off when they come back. That's your advice. Um, you don't want to start any childish drama, you know, about things that happened in the past. Address the past. Address the past, definitely. Yeah. You have someone who, with a hangman in reverse. We have someone who, you know exactly what you want. You know exactly what you want and you probably already have like a picture in your mind how you want the situation to go. But I'm telling you, you need to get out of your own way in this situation. Do not be combative in this reconciliation or when this person comes back. I'm going to draw an angel oracle card. To sum up this reading for you, give me a thumbs up if this resonates with you so far. And leave a comment. I love to read your comments. I hope you all like the new format that I am trying out here. Be sure to follow me on Instagram if you're not already. I have tons of content and promotions over there as far as personal readings. And if you want to purchase a personal reading, check out the description box. I accept PayPal and Venmo. One question is eleven eleven. That's eleven dollars and eleven cents. So Aquarius, the message the message that the angels have for you says you are protected from all types of harm. The worst is now behind you. I ask you to relax and feel safe. There may have been something about your person, Aquarius, that made you feel unsure, made you feel not safe. 
This is being clarified by the King of Swords in reverse. You are being called to let down some of your guard, just even if it's just a little bit. Even if it's just a little bit. Don't be so like Aquarius, you all can be like very like matter of fact, black and white. Emotions ain't got shit to do with this. Um, which is true in a lot of cases. And in a lot of cases, you know, you really need to be a little bit more open hearted. And again, we have the hangman in reverse. So you could be, um, and you've gotten that twice. You could be dealing with a Pisces, but when it's in reverse like this, it's basically saying like, don't be the reason you miss out on an opportunity. Okay, don't let your ego do that to you. Don't let your ego trick you into missing out on something that you really want. I mean, you want it because if you didn't, you wouldn't be watching this video. So, yeah, like it's okay to have feelings, Aquarius. Just don't be a fool, you know, but it's okay to have feelings. It's okay to, to want someone. I feel like there was a message directly aimed at a very small percentage of you. But yeah, it's okay to want someone. The worst is now behind you. I ask you to relax and feel safe. So those are your messages, Aquarius. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you later. Bye.